Hey guys, Ben here, and welcome back to another video on The Flash Season 5. Today we're going to be talking about some potential rumours, and this is going to be more of a kind of ranty video, but also we've got some new news as to what's going on with Carlos at the end of the season. Well, not really that much news, but it seems like it's going in that certain way that we talked about recently. So, if you do go on to enjoy the video, please be sure to leave a like and a comment. And subscribe if you're new so you don't miss any DC TV videos later this year. Okay, so we've got the Flash coming back sometime. It's either this week or next week. I can't confirm that right now because I don't know off the top of my head. But we're coming back very soon with episode 15. But as you know recently, if you follow my channel, we did that really kind of ranty video with the reports on Supergirl, Arrow and Legends all being supposedly being tossed around to get cancelled and I explained why it makes no sense, why obviously the source was not very reliable and it's just more of a rumour, it's a squashed up fake rumour that was just brought up and coming from we got this covered once again we've got another rumour of a supposed Flash team member leaving so they've reported that Supergo is going to get cancelled, they reported that Arrow is going to get cancelled, they reported that Legends is going to get cancelled, they reported that Daniel Panabaker might be leaving, they've reported that Carlos Valdez might be leaving, and now they're saying Tom Cavanaugh might be leaving, and all of that is with no proper source. They just say a source close to We Got This Covered, that is it, no evidence, and in the article they don't explain anything, it's just literally a rumour, and so it's unconfirmed and it is really frustrating it seems like they're just doing it to get it the attention because why not you know you'll get clicks and whatever you've got my click already but it's probably bullshit it's 99% bullshit I mean I do think Carlos is probably going to leave at the end of the season but that we all sort of presumed that already and they I guess came up with a report about it all right so let's go over Carlos's actual thing that he said at an event yesterday I believe it was or maybe it was earlier today but anyway he was asked a question at an event in Vancouver during a panel appearance if he was actually leaving the flash and then they did this really kind of funny thing if you watch the clip it's on Themyscira Bounds's Twitter you can check that out because I believe they were there and so Kavanaugh so Tom Kavanaugh was there he says he can't un he can't answer the question as his agent and so it's just so sort of, and so they just play around with the idea of him potentially not being able to answer and then he's eating a donut he's like oh I'd love to but I'm currently eating a donut so you know squashing the idea of him actually going he doesn't deny but he doesn't also confirm so by now we can all just presume that they are slowly writing him out of the show not because they want to but because I think Carlos wants to go back to Broadway I do believe or maybe he wants to do some films I don't know but it seems like bit by bit you see in the episodes he's kind of absent once every few episodes and then maybe he has less scenes and he's less sort of involved and so the panel appearance just sort of reaffirms the idea that he's probably leaving and they can't really say anything and yeah so again watch the clip and you understand it's kind of hard to explain but yeah let's move on to talk about the next thing and this is again from we got this covered and this is that Tom Kavanaugh may be potentially leaving the flash and so now this is I I have to say this again this is most likely bullshit and this is from we got this covered again still that same supposed really close source that we got this covered reporting this and I wouldn't believe it and I would say take it with a massive massive grain of salt over basically any article or any sort of outlet out there because they've got many things wrong in the past and it's just a rumor really and so they've said oh we're gonna they're cancelling all these shows they're gonna do that oh Danielle's gonna probably be leaving Carlos which I do believe Carlos is but we all guessed that like I said and so now they're saying oh Tom Kavanagh 
Who are you going to go next? Are you going to go Grant Gustin's going to leave next? It's really annoying that you have to put out rumours that you have no backed up evidence. Check your sources. Get like three sources behind you that confirm, yes, he's thinking of leaving. Rather than just one sort of shabby source that you presumably confirmed all these other ones from. So, yeah, it's just really poor reporting. And so, according to the report, it seems like... After Crisis on Infinite Earths, apparently Tom Kavanagh might be leaving, that being all the versions of Harrison Wells. And they might all be cro killed off, that's what they said. That is silly, I do believe we're probably going to see another version of Wells, whether it is Eobard Thorne or not. I think we'll see that, but killing them all off? No, that's not going to happen. And we know the fan favourite characters Tom is a fan favourite actor, and they know if they killed off all of them, there would be no way to bring him back, and he is such an essential part of the show, they have no reason to do that, and I don't think they would. Maybe they kill off one version of his character, but they won't kill all of them, so that's a bit silly. I don't know, I think that's them just sort of theorising. But, yeah, according to who we got this covered, they say Tom Kavanagh is going to be potentially leaving the show at the end of the season he may very well and i quote exit the series and so yeah that's all the evidence and that's all the source was able to potentially say that it might happen after crisis on infinite earths to close the story on his characters not only that but we'll probably see many versions of wells working together in crisis and it's possible that they may all die literally what is that? I seriously don't understand how you can put that in a report saying, oh, we, we've got a source that's confirming this, and then the source theorizes. The source actually tells them, because they've got it in quotes, the source theorizes that many versions of worlds are going to be working together in crisis, and it's possible they may all die. If you've got a source, it has to be 100% certain, and this source isn't even certain about its information. It can't even tell you if there's going to be these different versions of the worlds, and if all of them are going to die. It's them theorising. It's just stupid. It just emphasises the idea that I'm guessing Tom's not going to leave. I don't think he's going to leave. He has no reason. Like, I don't think he sort of did that much before The Flash. Like, before The Flash, he did... I know I saw him in Yogi Bear, he did a few other sort of TV shows that he was known for like Ed and so he doesn't really have like Broadway to go back to but I guess he could have different opportunities out there but yeah no solid evidence that he's going to be leaving this is sort of just in the rumor mill right now because again not a very reliable source really has no backed up information. They can't confirm even part of his story arc or anything like that. So, yeah, I don't think this is happening. But, again, it could happen. It could happen to anyone. It could happen to Candace Patton. It could happen to Grant Gustin. But that is all sort of just rumours. Obviously not Candace and Grant. That's just me coming up with a stupid idea. But, yeah, so I really don't believe he's going to leave. But I do think Carlos is you know, lining up to leave, and I don't think Danielle Panabaker is, so I made a video on that the other day about Danielle potentially leaving, but again, if you check that video out, take it with a massive grain of salt, because right now she's directing an episode that is titled Godspeed, that's going to be one of the biggest episodes of the whole season, we're seeing Godspeed for the first time, and we're in the future, and Barry knows about you while Thorne and Nora working together, so that's massive, and so with her sort of branching into this, the same thing goes for Tom Kavanagh, because he directs a lot of these episodes, he recently did the 100th episode, and that, even if they potentially exit, it gives them something to hold on to the show, why you would want to stick around on screen, is so you get that practice, and you get that time to direct off screen, and you can stick around, and a lot of actors try and do that, because most actors do want to eventually get to direct and making their own films so they can control things. And you see that with David Herbert recently, he's doing a Supergirl episode. And you see it multiple times, Tom's done it loads of times, I'm guessing. 
Grant's probably going to eventually do it. Maybe Stephen, Amel for Arrow. I don't know. But, yeah, it's all kind of lining up to be that. No, I don't think Danielle and Tom Gavin are going to leave because they've got options behind the camera as well, as well as being on camera. So, I don't believe it is true. I think this is all rumour. I think it's 99% bullshit. So, that's just me. I don't know if you agree or not. Do you really trust we got this covered with this or do you think it's not true do you think it's just a rumor that they're just sort of spreading around that this source is very unreliable because it seems to be very unreliable and we all kind of knew carlos was going to be leaving before the report so yeah thank you guys so much for watching this video sorry for a sort of another ranty video i have been making like a few of these recently and I kind of enjoy them, but I kind of don't at the same time because I feel bad. But anyway, guys, I will catch you guys later. Goodbye.